to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. So today is going to be my much requested apartment tour video. So I've been procrastinating doing this video, but I finally found some time today to film it. And I decided to go ahead and do it because if I didn't, I wasn't gonna find time again until like January. So I just buckled down, took a while to film because I never knew. I never knew how difficult it was to actually film like a tour video. I always thought, oh, you just hold your camera and wave it around and show them, but Girl, if you want it to be like halfway decent, you have to put a little bit more effort to that. So kudos to you guys who do a lot of apartment tours or house tours and it looks just beautiful. So I had tons and tons and tons of fun decorating this apartment. So you're gonna notice that the apartment has more of like a simplistic decor. Um, there's not a lot of clutter. It's very sort of like clean lines, just what we need, sort of that kind of thing. Um, I used to have a very busy decor style. I used to just ramp everything together but my husband is the complete opposite he likes minimal 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 things I noticed that over the years it started rubbing off on me a little bit kind of came to like a halfway point where I still like my decor style but I've included a lot of minimal things especially that we are really not apartment people we're house people coming from a house to an apartment is like a huge difference and we just know that we're not gonna be in an apartment for a really long time so I didn't really want to get any big pieces that we're not potentially going to fit into the home that we're gonna have later on. So I wanted to just make this feel like home and make it feel nice and chic in my style, but still keep in mind that um, I don't wanna get any pieces that just go with this apartment and that cannot transition on to like a home or something like that. that make sure you like this video and also share it on your social media and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you don't miss any of my new videos. So with that very long intro, <laughs> let's jump right into this. All right, we're gonna start at the front door. Straight ahead is the front door. On the left-hand side, I just put the trash can there just because that was the best place for the trash can to go. On the right-hand side, that door there is just a coat closet and it's kind of a mess, so we're not gonna open that. And then the two brown little closets on the end there just hold kind of like extra towels and candles and things like that. To the right of that closet, we have straight ahead the guest bathroom. To the right, just a wall, and to the left, the washer and dryer unit, which was the most important thing for us when we were looking for an apartment was to have a washer and dryer in unit. Right across from the washer and dryer, you have an empty wall. And all we've put there right now are just those little mirrors that we had in our house previously. I'm not really sure what to do with this place. I'm thinking of putting maybe like a console table where we can put like our keys and bags. But I don't know. If you guys have any ideas, write it in the comments. Straight ahead, we've got the beautiful guest bathroom. Let's head back over to the kitchen and I can give you guys a slight overview of what I've done in here. So now we're going to move on to the living room, which is my favorite, favorite, well, one of my favorite parts of this apartment. I 
absolutely love how high and huge the windows are here. They let a ton of light in. Although this couch is absolutely beautiful, it is not the couch that we're going to be staying with. We actually ordered a gray one, but it was out of stock and we're waiting for it to come in. So they give us this one instead to use for a while. To the thing that made us get the apartment at least he made our decision very easy is this beautiful spiral staircase right here it is gorgeous and it leads up to my beauty room and then to the right of that we have got our little reading nook area it's a den but we just turned it into like a little reading nook Welcome to our bedroom where we keep everything pretty simple. Uh, we don't clutter anything in here. We like to have room to move around. We don't like a bunch of stuff around. On that little red um, little ottoman, we put our bags. That's just where we put our bags at the end of the day. And then we have our little basket there, which you guys saw in the previous haul. And then um, I have a full length mirror on the other side of the TV with our Paris picture from our house. And then this is our bed, which is really comfortable. And then on top of our bed, these pictures are super meaningful to us. As you know, I'm from Cameroon, Africa, and Chris is from Congo, Africa. And those pictures are from places in Congo and Cameroon. And they just remind us of where we come from every morning when we wake up. It's just amazing to look at. All right, so these doors, one leads to the closet on the left hand side, that's the closet, but that's Chris's closet. I took up the upstairs closet and the door straight ahead is our bathroom. One of my 2017 resolutions is to be more organized and that started with my bathroom. So I keep very little on my bathroom. So this is my side, a few cleansers, moisturizer, serums. Now I can't say nothing about the drawers, it's probably full of stuff, but the top is very nice. And then in the middle we just have candles, mouthwash, toothpaste, and then of course that's Chris's side of the vanity. And then we have this beautiful deep deep tub oh, this tub is so amazing to soak in and i also keep a couple of bath bombs right there just to throw them in as soon as i'm ready to take a hot bath all right let's head on up to my beauty room Every time I get up here, I always have to look down just because I love this view of the apartment once you get up the stairs. So this is what you see when you first come up the stairs to my beauty room. There's just a mirror there and then I have these tiny little mirrors that I used to have in my old beauty room. And this is just kind of a view of everything. Everything on the left hand side that I'm not showing you is an absolute mess right now. But yeah, this is just what my beauty room looks like. I may or may not be a little obsessed with rose gold right now. I mean, it looks like rose gold threw off my computer table right now, but you know, whatever. All 
right guys this video has come to an end I really really hope you guys enjoyed it and for those of you guys who saw my haul then you saw all the little pieces that I picked up and showed you guys come together to really make this place feel like home thank you so much for watching make sure you thumbs up this video subscribe so you don't miss any of my new videos and I will definitely see you guys in my next one bye